Hey guys and welcome to Social Connect Review. Um, I have the Pro version here because uh, I'm very cool. <laughs> um, this, is, uh, this is a software uh, developed by uh, Kartik, Kartik Ramani. I hope I pronounced that correctly and uh, Sam Becker. Uh, both of these guys have uh, superhero special powers so don't be surprised if they... Uh oh, okay. There. Yep, yep, here they come. Yeah, okay, just a second. Okay, that's good. Okay, let's continue with the with the um, review. Uh, what I like about uh, um, any software that Katrick is involved with is that you immediately have a quick start guide and video tutorials here, and everything is so clear and uh, easy to digest. Um, okay, so to create um, your social connect, you go to create, and over here you just uh, put in your uh, name, and you can uh, select either niche templates, flat colors, or gradient colors. So let's go with uh, niche templates, and let's choose. You can uh, preview them over here. This is what it will uh, look like in the end. So I'm going to choose this one. And actually, not to go to the beginning of all of this, I'm just going to show you with the one that I've created that is actually um, called uh, Social Connect Review. So you put your name here, you choose the uh, your template, then click Next. This is the welcome text and you have this sort of image here that shows you what is what in these settings. Um, I would prefer, you know, if I could uh, edit it uh, on uh, a page like, like this, already, uh, already done uh, social connect so that I can, you know, what you see is what you get editor. But it doesn't matter, it's uh, actually, you know, quite simple as it is. And uh, I already suggested to Sam to put uh, maybe GIFs here and he already um, uh, said they are working on it and that's because, um, like I said, they have special powers. <laughs> okay, so you just put your, um, uh, your title here. You can choose to show online users, show number of comments, speaker time zone. These little buttons over here are for likes. Um, the header type you can put solid color gradient and image. This is a custom made banner I made for this uh, review. The button color is this over here that will be um, for posting. So if you write a, a comment, uh, the button below that comment to post your comment. The link color um, is the one for the reply button. So as you can see, you know this. Uh, if there were no if there were no images like this on the side, I wouldn't know what the link color was. So just a little note over here, over there. Um, so the next one is uh, login settings. I suggest you enable this because this way you will connect collect your uh, emails. Visitors will have to you can uh, uh, enable or disable this button to uh, enable comments by guest or you have to require a login to leave a comment so this way you can force a user to uh, you know log in via Facebook which is really easy just click a button and then you uh, collect their email address which is pretty cool next we have notification settings and you have this notes over here that explains what this setting is and that helps and but the image helps more because it shows you exactly what it is so it's this a uh, little banner over here that shows how many new comments are since your last visit. Okay, so next we have broadcast settings and as you can see at the moment there is no image here so I can really tell what this does. So there is this uh, note here that explains it but um, I sort of get it and don't get it. So basically this is a, a message that will be displayed and you can pick the time interval uh, how long it will be um, displayed on the social connect and that is uh, this message over here right here and it's pretty cool 
Okay, so let's go to the next setting. Uh, this is the gamification settings, which is, I guess, for fun. Um, it creates roles based on mastery or knowledge of chat members. Basically, you can choose how many uh, you know likes some, someone has or replies, and or you can choose between these. And then you can you know assign a role here and give them a badge. So this is serves as a motivation for users to. Um, to be active in your chat and perhaps you can also you know give them some rewards if they are the top uh, if they have you know top ranked uh, uh, badge over here okay so on to the next one social share settings this is pretty simple so Facebook and Twitter enable disable uh, moderation settings uh, okay this is cool uh, approval settings you can approve all Request approval, reject all with comments uh, with images, comments with URLs. You might want to put here requires approval so that some doesn't spam a lot. Um, okay, I didn't quite get the slur words here. Um, okay, so I didn't know what slur words were, so I checked real quick, and these are the words that you can uh, enter here and separate by a comma. That and you can select then if it requires approval or the just uh, reject them all to um, to uh, well to ban someone you know to ban these words um, so you can avoid spamming uh, monetization settings uh, this is also cool you can uh, upload your top and bottom banner and put the banner URL here and you can also uh, choose how many between how many comments you will uh, put additional banners so they could be a top banner then like seven comments and then another banner uh, yeah really that's how it works okay next one uh, mail and integration this is this is really cool in my opinion you can send an email after a user registers send an email when the user is tagged uh, subscribe to the chat community uh, and uh, you can send them after they've been away from the chat for a long time. Uh, you can send an email uh, when they uh, receive a badge, for example, and so on. This is the final setting where you can basically uh, visit your uh, social connect that you created. You can embed it on any uh, web page using the HTML code, or you have also have a WordPress plugin, which is cool and it's easy to set up you just download the plugin and this is your API key for activating the plugin and once you do that uh, you have the plugin here um, on your WordPress dashboard and then you just select you know the um, the social connects uh, pages that you created on your um, on your dashboard over here you can just select them here you get the short code and then you just enter a copy and paste the short code onto your web page. Okay. Uh, video, video tutorials are here. Um, they are pretty good. Uh, you might want to um, go over them because it has some features that you might not be used to. And also you have a quick uh, start guide here which is uh, pretty good uh, quality written if you are more of a, you know, a reading type. And these are the features once your uh, social connect page is activated you can preview it edit it you can add clients really simple here although if you already have a list of clients that you just select one and give them access to uh, moderation is basically you know um, you can you have approved rejected comments uh, blacklisted comments and all that you can uh, pick and choose here what you want the autoresponder settings it's cool that you can um, you can integrate uh, the go to webinar so you have webinar integrations which is cool and you also have you can choose uh, there are listed autoresponders auto here but you can just if you, yours is not listed you can uh, choose others and just uh, upload your html code over here so you can connect with any autoresponder out there you have Facebook share settings that looks like it looks like this. You just enter the title, description, and the image. Uh, retargeting codes, just enter them here. You have uh, a Facebook perfect audience and ad row. Okay, uh, language settings. 
so you can change anything here that you want to uh, to your own language okay you have geo settings which is cool so you can the disconnect will be displayed only to countries that are added in the list so you can enable this and then just uh, pick all the countries or any country listed in here and add a message okay so that's basically it you can of course go here for a quick uh, code if you want to embed it somewhere and uh, that's basically it you can go here to manage clients and you know add them one by one and then just uh, you know select them if you um, if you go here so that's basically it for this review and i'll see you next time bye bye